So obviously everyone sneaks out of their house to go party and stuff. Um, after I'd given my life to the Lord, I was sneaking out of my house to go hit. So when my brothers were in high school and stuff, they were, you know, the partiers and they were, you know, my brother got drafted and he was, you know, living, living it up a little bit and friends were always over at the house. And so when I was getting to high school, I was like, man, that's my turn now, you know? So that's what I knew what was right. And that's what I thought what was right. I thought this is normal, you know, this is right. This is the way life is and it's what you do. So it's my turn and, um, I think one of the reasons why I ran to that was honestly, I, I'm not a fan of being in, around a ton of people. And the only way I would loosen up was to use something or do, you know, drink or smoke or something like that. And then I would ease up and get comfortable. And then all of a sudden, you know, it turns into more and more and more. And I just realized looking back, I'm trying to, be comfortable around these people, but I, there's bigger and better things that I need to be focusing on. Not trying to impress any of my peers or not trying to conform to this way. You know, one of my favorite verses is, be not conformed to this world, but live transformed by the renewing of your life, um, the renewing of your mind, and Romans 12 too. And so that, you know, that was a verse that really stuck out to me was, man, I'm just like trying to please everyone else. And that's why I'm, really doing what I'm doing because I just want to be comfortable around everyone. I want to be, you know, because if I'm not comfortable, they're not going to, you know, be cool with me or whatever. And so when I'm, when I am this way, I can, you know, be cool with everyone and this and that. And it's like, well, like, what am I doing? I have this gift in baseball and I'm just going to blow it away because I want to be comfortable around, you know, my high school peers. It just doesn't make any sense. So, um, I never would have come to that conclusion without my faith though. I really wouldn't, I never would have set questioned that process. I was actually, you know, this is funny. So obviously everyone sneaks out of their house to go party and stuff. Um, after I'd given my life to the Lord, I was sneaking out of my house to go hit. <laughs> oh yeah. So I was sneaking out and I was going and hitting late at night. Um, I had my neighbor, best friend, Hayden Stevens. Um, he'd have the car hot and ready. <laughs> hot and ready to get hop, hop on in. And I didn't, I didn't feel bad because I knew my intentions were pure. 